Hey guys, I'm Janet, on occasion you may remember me from such episodes as 3 and 7 and 17. So, here we are again, um, we're about to do yet another boss fight, I think, when we go in here, maybe, what is happening? Oh, whoops. <laughs> I press W to move forwards, but of course, I use the mouse to control the guy, and I use WASD to control the guy playing the guy, so... Confused the heck out of me. The guy who used... Sorry. The guy who used to live here was a major drag. Though I'll admit, he was not dull. He... He was, he was a knife. He was a boring knife. Guy had a plan for every eventuality. That is, except for the great transcendence. Okay. Uh, there's a shop. Ooh. This is cheap. What is that? Is that a paintbrush? Is that that guy's paintbrush? It costs what we have. How can I not? Well, now we're broke. But we have a paintbrush. I didn't know it would do that, but... Poor, huh? Poor. No refunds. Poor. 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 Janet, stop saying four. Never. Four. No, 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 no. Four. Wait, no, that's the one that should be over there. And you can, you can come up here. Four. <laughs> that's really good. <laughs> More junk. Want it? Yeah, it's an Ouroboros. Like Ouroboros. You know, the snake eating the snake. Ouroboros, but it's Ouroboros. Our... Our Robert. Which? Oh, what was it from Red Dwarf? It was Our Rob or Ross. Didn't even know his name. It was Rob or Ross. Who could tell? Our Rob or Ross. Anyway. <laughs> so we got a new card. We got uh, Old Robot. Hey team. Uh, me bot. See, these named ones, just, ugh, I don't like them. I don't like these trans, like, transforming ones. Transformers are, are boring. That's right, I said it. Let's see. So, shield bot will be coming in on the side. Um, I mean, sentry drone, this one, when it dies, it makes, yeah, when it dies, it makes an item. Not makes an item, draws a card. Wait, no, hang on. Random card. Yeah, okay. Sorry, I mean, I clicked on that and I just didn't even pay attention to the entire thing. Let's go here. And that'll do. This is a new day recording, so I'm, um... I don't know, half asleep, I guess? So, uh, right. I wonder... So I could use an emerald vessel to finish him off. Might end draw... It is my turn to draw. So what else is going to come in? A couple of units. One's a vessel, though, so I don't have to worry about that so much. But it will imp it will power things. Once you destroy that, that will get destroyed. So actually, these two moving forwards, I could then attack and deal with that. Because that will then deal with uh, shield bot. Though I don't like shield bot doing two damage, personally. So what I'm going to do this round, I think, is simply block uh, all the incoming stuff. Of course, we do retaliate, and we do have shields, and... There's stuff that our our guys can do. And this is useful. These two will come in as well. And, uh, yeah. Just all of the stuff will get taken out once this guy gets taken out. So I like that. We could actually just have them take out themselves. Maybe just get another one of these. So let's go with this guy. Put him here. And, uh, that's it. We've, <laughs> we've taken out all of those cards. Feels good. Feels good. Okay, good. Now, what are you? Oh, damage. That's a lot of damage. Only got one health, though, so I don't have to worry too much. Good. Especially because that guy's going to blow up and everything will die. That's good news. Alright, here he comes. Good. Okay, at some point I do need to play something that can do something. You know, that can do some damage. 
that'd be quite useful. I mean, he's got one health, and he'll explode. Which does make this a little bit iffy. But I'm still tempted. I'm still tempted. Uh, what's that one? Overclocked, of course. If he dies, he's dead forever. <gasps> Spooky. Alright, let's grab some more useful cards. Energy bots, yeah, that's fine, I guess. Yeah, let's put a me bot here so he explodes. We'll lose our boy, but that's fine. Hang on a minute. When gem vessels on the owner's side of the board die, when gem vessels die, they detonate. Oh no, I think when these guys died, they just they detonated gem vessels. Oh well that's silly. That's silly. He just makes these explode. Ah oh, well, never mind. And now they're not going to explode. And he's dead. Good. Uh, yeah, there's another bot there. And Bolt Hound. I mean, Bolt Hound's pretty good, isn't he? Let's put him over here. He can do some damage. That'll do. It's nothing much, but it's something. Oh, and then Bolt Hound will kill both of those. That's good. Uh, Shield Bot. I suppose we can throw Shield Bot out there. Put him in here. It's not much, but it'll do something. And I guess I'll put out... Nah, I don't have enough energy. Oh, flying. Flying guy. Oh, no. We need to start doing something useful. Shield that jet. Can I just get my uh, uh, attacks on either side, boy? You know the one. Well, we've already won, so it doesn't really matter. Wow, three overkill, too. That was a very straightforward fight. Uh, okay. Oh yeah, so that's... We went up those stairs, didn't we? So that leads to here. It's the same as uh, the layout for the tower. That confused me at the time, if you remember. I ended up going down the stairs I just went up because I thought it would start me on the other side of the... Anyway. You were, you were there. I doubt you remember it. It's very minor detail. I just think it's funny that I sort of have that same thing of, hang on, didn't I come from that way? How... What? <laughs> Forgetting where I was. Let's go with... Right, so we've got this guy coming in. He's not going to be a problem. So, actually... Oh, nothing costs one apart from the Sapphire Vessel, so I guess I'll put him out anyway. And I'll just put him somewhere. That'll do. Oh, he actually does damage. Oh, crap. I saw the, the vessel and didn't even pay attention to the stats. That won't do. How come he's doing damage, then? I mean, this guy isn't. It's not a constant on this guy's army, so... Seems a bit weird, but I suppose it'll do. So I can do two damage to that guy and take him out. He's going to blow up when he gets hit, which is a bit annoying. Um, I'm going to go with... You draw a card first. Okay, let's let's draw... Let's draw another one of these. They're too useful just to throw in the way of stuff, so... Uh, I'm going to kill him. I know the exoskeleton, it would be nice if he could actually damage our opponent, but at least we can get rid of that guy. And yep, we'll take more damage, but that's okay. Mostly, kinda. What's this one? When a card bearing the sigil is played, all gem vessels on the owner's side of the board gain nano armor. Oh. Suppose that's okay? Suppose I can allow it? So, let's go... Oh, I need to pick a card. Let's pick this one. Sniper bot. So I'll do that one. Yeah, well, yeah, he's going to attack us a couple of times and then die, but that's fine. And then we'll go sniper bot here, where he can't be attacked. And maybe I'll shoot him, actually, then the shield will help us. Yeah, I think that'll be a nice, a nice way to go about it. So we'll destroy that, and the shield will keep that safe. Good. So, a couple damage. No good, but it'll be fine. Alright, let's grab you. Ruby Vessel. He's going to do four damage, huh? That's too much damage. Fish Bot, I could put in the way. Fish Bot does no damage, but he will survive a couple of turns. So we'll do that, and I'll put Ruby Vessel there. Okay, time to turn this around. You know, in some turns. Okay, let's go with... God, we can do one damage, then it's another Explode Bot turning up. Who's going to kill Fish Bot? 
That won't do one bit. Just needs me to do damage. Gem-bound Ripper. That's more like it. Okay, we can use that. So I'm going to get rid of the Sapphire Vessel. Because I... Oh, wait, that makes it cheaper. But we do still have the resources for it. So... Bam. Bam. You actually have to hit it twice because it has the shields. That's pretty funny. One hammer strike to get rid of the shield and one to destroy it. There we go. That was a hell of a turnaround. Bad fish. Oh, he's still alive. We're good. I mean, he's going to attack and blow it up. and Well, everything's going to get blown up, but it's fine. Shield bot does one damage. I guess I could get rid of that and and get an extra damage in there. There we go. Good fish. Bang. So, how much overkill? All right, three. It's fine. That was definitely a little bit close. Ah, good. Another checkpoint. So it's definitely a little bit close. We did uh, <laughs> we did get down to like zero health left, you know, essentially. So your items are replenished. And those bots back there are permanently offline. Good. Oh, right. This uber bot. Well, you'll see. Sure we will. Hey there, buddy. There isn't one. There's no boss for this level. That's your job. <laughs> what? Please. Paint me a face. Oh, <laughs> what? <laughs> ah! <laughs> oh! Ah! <laughs> uh. <laughs> fun. Oh, dude, that's creepy. Soulless. That looks like um, Mr. Mr. Casino, whatever the hell his name was. Oh, he's oh, he's a bit he's a bit jaunty. Look at this jaunty fellow. Oh, I like this jaunty fellow. <laughs> oh, hello. Hang on one moment. Hang on a minute. Hang on a minute. Oh no, I can't check. The board on the left. There was a little picture of a guy. You remember? There was a little picture of a guy, and I wasn't sure what the puzzle was. It was to the left of the the you know the card table. Uh just past the clock. There's a little picture of a guy, and I didn't know what he did. But I have a feeling we have to change his face to match, but I can't... Oh, crap. Okay, I just said that, apparently. Well, let's hope that's the one. God, I am born. I feel as though I can breathe now. Well, now I don't know what to make of it. Another thing. I will need a special power. A game rule to call my own. You painted me such a beautiful face, so please... Oh, crap. You play a card. A random card takes five damage. Oh, God. Every time a card dies, a random card takes damage. Uh, one of my cards gains nano armor. All cards take one damage. That. That is actually a good thing, I think. Your turn starts. All cards take one damage. You play a card. All cards take one damage. God, that's, that has a potential to work, you know. Uh, God, I have no idea. It's tough. I mean, this one, all cards taking one damage. Has potential just because our, like, uh, vessels have a shield. So every time I play one of those, I essentially get two chances, right? They won't die. I can still use that to block. So, like, every time I play a card, all cards take one damage, might be good, but it really depends. The Our opponent might have a, a ton of cards that have a load of health, and that might completely screw me. It's a tough one. It's definitely a tough one. Um, God, this is a gamble. This is definitely a gamble. Because, yeah, my, my vessels can only take three damage before they go, basically. They take, they're shielded from one, and then they can take two more hits. It really depends on how much health the enemy cards have, because I can only play one card per turn, consistently. 
Because, you know, that's how many I can draw. Obviously, I start with a few more. So, every time a card dies, a random card is played. But by who? That sounds good, because that will definitely take out, like, most of his cards. If it happens to take out his cards. But it won't take out mine if they've got shields. Which, again, that doesn't sound great, though, does it? Um... One of his cards against nano armor, I think, is awful. This is really difficult to choose. These are all quite good. Okay, my turn starts, a random card is played. But by who? By who? Who plays a random card? Is it either? I really have no idea. If it's every time uh, a card dies, a random card is played, that means he's just replacing all of his cards. Every time I play a card, a random card is played. Uh, sounds maddening. It sounds absolutely maddening. This is hard. This is hard to pick. Every time you play a card, a random card takes five damage. That means if I'm on the back foot, it's more likely that his cards will take damage. You know? If I'm outnumbered, I can equalize that quicker with this. Same goes for him, but I mean, I'm smarter than him, hopefully. We're doing it. I have shields as well. So the shields applies here too. Random card takes five damage. Doesn't matter if it's one of my cards that has a shield. Good. This could work. Let's see how this plays out. The light in here is also quite spooky. It is rather spooky. Uh, so Ruby Vessel, Amoebot, Sentry Drone, or Sniper Bot. I mean, none. None. Okay, this... I've definitely goofed. Sort of. I've definitely sort of goofed. Because if I play anything, <laughs> immediately something's going to take damage. And that's only going to be me. See? It's not great, is it? It's not great. So that'll have to do. What an interesting boss. I mean, we can just, you know... We can just play again. It doesn't really matter. Hmm. i gonna grab another one of these. Hedge my bets a bit. Please, if I take four damage from that, that bot, we Yeah, I was gonna say, if I take damage from that, then we've lost. And <laughs> we just lost. <laughs> oh, good. Love that. Uh... Alright, I guess I'm having to use this now. It seems to be my cards every time. That's really bad. Is that a random card? I don't believe it. I simply don't believe it. Alright, please be something that does a ton of damage. Oh, it does, but... It's been my card every time. This is really bad. But, yeah, that'll have to do. Let's, um... I mean, I guess kill this guy. We're gonna take one damage anyway. Alright, let's see if we can do anything about it. So, we're gonna lose that sniper bot. And I decided not to get something that can jump. Which is a pain. Okay, what I can do... Sentry Drone, here. Oh my god, yeah, it's been my card every time! This is a random card! I really don't believe it. I mean, it's very likely that I'm going to get hit now, but... Of course. It seems to be whatever I played last. Which isn't random. And I can't attack that now that I don't have the sniper buff. So, honestly, like, yeah, finish... Finish the game. Just kill me. Well, what's going to take damage? Oh, was it that that took damage? Oh, okay. So they can attack the enemy. Just seems highly unlikely. So, I've lost anyway, but... But yeah, that doesn't work. It doesn't work. Just because we start first, basically. Oh, they started first. Which means every card you place, you take damage? So, yep, yeah, don't know a boss. Oh, hang on a minute. 
Oh, same boss. I can't even, I can't check his face. Game development is an iterative process. I'm not sure if the last rule was really working. Maybe we can try something else. Uh, every time you play a card. <laughs> I can't pick that. Uh, every time a card dies. Dunno. Maybe actually that, but yeah. My turn starts, a random card is played. Is that going to be their card or mine? I don't know. Or completely random. Let's find out. I feel good about this one. Bolt Hound. You're joking. Bolt Hound on turn one. Cool. Coolio. Cooly, cooly, cool. Shield bot costs more energy than we have. Ruby Vessel. Awesome. <laughs> oh dear. Bang, bang. Now it's my turn. Oh, I just got a free double gunner. Okay, that's weird and I love it. I'm kind of annoyed that Bolt Hound ran in front of it. When opposing creatures placed. Ah. Good. That I can deal with. I can also do some damage to it, actually. Ooh. I am... Okay, I'm a genius. What am I going to do? Sentry drone. Oh, it's going to go, it's go that way now. After attacking. Okay. Uh, oh, no, this is fine. Sentry drone here. So I get a damage into him. And then emerald vessel here. Which is going to pull this guy here and I can kill him. Annoyingly, that alarm bot is there, which is a bit of a problem. I'd love the double gunner to move, but it's not in the cards. Get it? Because we're playing cards. I know, it's pretty funny. Also, that's not going to do any damage to the guy, just to cards, which is a shame. Nice. Okay. Sniper bot. Perfect, I can kill that alarm clock. Oh, also, Emerald Vessel is doing damage now, thanks to the alarm clock. Oh, except there's an insect drone here. Oh, a sniper bot will sort it. Okay, now we're good. I can also kill the swap bot, which will spare him. Or that can kill him. We do two damage per hit now, which is nice. Uh, I think I might let the Ruby Vessel handle it, even though we are buffing our damage right now. Nothing seems to have much help. So I think we're okay. Yeah, they're both gone. Let's get a little close. Bolt Hound just moved out in front of us. Um, let's get another card out. So that Bolt Hound will try and move to something else, which is fine, I think. Maybe. I would like that Insect Drone killed. I can do that with Sniper Bot, but I'd also like to block some other things. Uh, let's go with... I mean, I can only place one thing, so I may as well just place the shield bot, right? So I place shield bot. That's going to do two damage. Whoops. Instead of one, so I'm going to have to do this, you know? And block it that way. And I think that's... That's just it. I'm just going to go with that. I mean, I could get the Ami bot out as well, actually. If I do this. Which I'm going to, because I think it'll be fun. And now, let's go. So, got a little bit of damage in. Nothing major. But something. Nice. Good. Uh, Gorange's Vessel. This was rather exciting. But now it doesn't really do anything. Uh, we need damage on it, which we don't have. Guess I won't bother playing it. I think I'll just wait. That'll get killed. He'll move forwards and then actually kill the shield bot and then swap. But once it's swapped, once this is swapped from having taken damage, I can use the sniper bot. Oh, actually no, it will kill me. It won't take damage. I'll just hit it with the sniper bot, then that'll make it swap. Oh no. Ah, we'll work it out. Probably. Oh, some overkill. Can't shoot it, sadly. It's okay. I can shoot that. Definitely, definitely got me. Sentry drone. Oh, good. I'll kill this guy. Feels good. Uh, let's go damage. Well, potential for damage. 
insta kill, three health, I like that. But we're gonna go with the bolt hound. And that'll do. Boom. And he'll move forwards and get gunned down. Excellent. And the explosive bot. Oh no. Oh, he got me. Blank boss, make rule. Break game? Maybe? And I'm sure you guys have found a rule that completely breaks it. But uh, this seems to be going okay. So, you know, fine. You picked such a cool mechanic for phase one. I think we should elaborate on that design process. Uh... Uh, I don't know. What could possibly get us out of this? Um, I play a card that will take one damage. Might be crazy good. I've got a good feeling about it somehow. Just given what my cards are, you know? I really don't know. Actually, no, if I play a card, then all cards take damage. If I play something that has one health, it dies. My turn starts, all cards take one damage. That means that mm, it'll happen after he has played cards, and then my cards can do something. Which means that cleans the board before I play cards. So I'm going to go with this. I'm going to go with this. This will clear his board. Maybe. Oh dear. Could I, could I watch that? Oh my god, a couple of things survived somehow. How did they survive? Oh, I start my turn, so his cards died. Sick. I like it. Alright, so that did seem to do the job. Uh, good fish. I won't allow you to play a card before you draw a new one. So, this one has one health, but has a shield, which will save something else for another... another turn. So I put that there. Good. I put it... Cost six energy for good fish. Hey, I thought that. I didn't even head that cost three. Weird. I don't know either. Um, let's put automaton here because we can. It'll do one damage, and that's good enough for me. Uh, I think that's it, though. I think that's all I'll do. Okay. Are you already in the lead? And uh, now I can make a sniper bot have a shield. Or do I want that to have a shield? So I can have more health. He's going to do two damage, so I guess I want this to count now. Uh, maybe. Let's do that. Oh. Oh, it costs damage despite shields. Ah, crap. Okay, so... Um... So, okay. That is going to make things cheaper, so that's not going to help. Alright, I guess we just put good fish out. Put good fish here. He's taken damage, but it hasn't swapped his damage yet, which is interesting. It should be after a card bearing the sigil is dealt damage. So things taking one damage per turn apparently doesn't count as having been dealt damage, which is really quite bizarre. Not really sure what that's about. But um, I'm going to do that. So I'm going to do more damage than I'm taking. Oh, and I can choose where I'm attacking. Oh my god, that's really funny. Uh, that I have that as well on this thing. It's a good fish. So he's dead. He's been attacking for one. How about just one more... Let's see how this plays out. Hang on, are these both... 
Are these both going? On my turn starts, a random card is played. And they all take one damage. I play a card. He plays a leap bot. How much health does a leap bot have? If it's one, then this is fine. Hmm. Uh. Yeah, I think that is fine. I think. Yeah, that's fine. That's the random card. And that's the leap bot. That's two health. Okay, that's suddenly quite frustrating. That's fine. Uh, I think we've won anyway. So, uh, I'll just grab whatever. It's a leap bot. I mean, they do no damage, so that's sort of irrelevant. It's just blocked the insect drone. So yeah, I need to do two damage, which I'm about to do. I'm about to do three. Can I do any more? No, I can't. Wow. That's, um... That's silly. Alright, fine. You go there. And, uh... All this is free right now. That's fun. There we go. Oh, he seems unimpressed. Just got Painter's Servant achievement. Alright, only one more. And uh, it's it's uh, our robot friend. Oh, yep, yeah, thanks. Twelve. Twelve bucks. Now what's this? Ooh, another upgrade. One final, like, magic upgrade. Oh, it's actually going to all of them. Oh, right. This up yeah, of course. Uh, so, we can have it give us more energy. Every time I play one, our energy goes up. That's sort of massive. Uh, God, every time I play one, it shoots you. Wow. Okay, that's sort of nuts that they could come in, and I could kill them before they even attack and lower my shield. And that will working as flying enemies that tend to have, like, no health. So, actually, that's sort of massive. That's really good, too, just because it means I can get, like, a max level card out on my third turn if I just play... Um, you know, these every time. Which is, again, a real big deal. But I think being able to take a, a shot just keeps those lanes empty. Uh, which is sort of awesome. But then do I need to? Because they have a shield, which means they will always last a couple turns. So if there's something attacking them, it almost doesn't matter. But it will be able to keep birds. But what also would keep, kill birds is to have that. So... I'm not sure... This would also be great. Basically, these are all really good, and I, I don't know what would be the best. This would sort of make my turrets obsolete. Do I want to do that? I mean, I don't see why not, right? Why not? Yeah, let's make my turrets obsolete. Screw it. Brilliant. Okay, cool. Now, let's um, get out of here, I suppose. Cool. And uh, there is a shop. And we do have 12 now, so I could upgrade something. You can also recycle something, I think. Or is that swap? I'm not sure. I'm gonna, I'm gonna upgrade something again. Pick one of your cards. Alright. Uh, Autobot, we haven't done anything with yet. We haven't found him yet. Uh, so every time he's he's killed, it creates a new one. I mean, he's maximum expense, which is weird. Weird how expensive he is. So this... Oh, wait. That one is... Borrower, so it'll always jump in the way of things, which is quite nice. He can block flying. He can shoot whatever he likes. Ah, these don't feel great, honestly. These don't feel great. Um, I mean, Mighty Leap isn't bad, just so we can block stuff. That way I always get like a one turn block, but then he's max cost when I could just throw out a... anything else. I'm not sure how great this guy is, but Sniper might be interesting. Just because no matter where he is on the board, I can shoot at whatever. And if he dies, I can place him again. So I always just get an additional damage somewhere where it's useful. Potentially. So I guess I'll do that. It's only one damage, but... 
It's one damage that I can have wherever I want, which suddenly makes it a lot more valuable. That can't have been correct. So, I don't know. That'll do. And yeah, I have no idea what the raw robot uh, will do. Even if, like He might just be an infinite card, like you know we've had in the past, but costing as much as he does to play, uh, him coming back into a hand doesn't really let you just sort of keep playing him in in the same way that we've had with like infinite keith or something you know it's not like you can't just sort of play that as a freebie and have other stuff uh you know ready that's gonna be the only card you can play if you play it so don't know i have a feeling there might be something to him not sure but we'll see so what i should have done is simply teleported but what I should have done even more than that is I should have ended the episode, because it had already been half an hour. And that's what I'm going for with this series. Though it rarely works. So guys, if you enjoyed this, please do comment, like, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Take care, guys.